I have been experimenting with a uh, experimental kind of drug <laughs> and it makes me have uh, conversations with uh, imaginary characters. Okay? <laughs> this one time I had a conversation with a younger me that was born blind. This one time I uh, spoke to God about my son, my gay son. But this time I kind of had a conversation with, uh, with a particular part of my body. <laughs> so, uh, okay, I had a five minute conversation with my body. Alright? And don't judge me, because that would make you all assholes. <laughs> um, actually, that would make them a dick. Okay, there we go. I'm still high. I, I think I'm still high. Okay, but I might as well introduce you guys. Poetry stamp people. This is Bart. Bart, this is the poetry stamp people. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I saw them. I saw them when you walked up here to talk. <laughs> yeah, and now you're just uh, staring at a wall. I'm sorry. That's cool, man. That's cool. It's not like I mind or anything. Are you cool with me talking to them? Yeah. I'm cool. Are you cool? I'm cool. I'm, are you guys cool? Yeah. 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 That's very cool. So, what? Why would they be dicks if they judged me and not assholes? Because dicks can't stop themselves from poking their heads in everyone else's business. Is that obvious? <laughs> I don't think that's very obvious, but I guess that's because I'm not a dick. <laughs> yeah, you're an elbow. <laughs> Dude, everyone cares about faces, dicks, vaginas, boobs, and me. Nobody gives a shit about elbows, and nobody. Gives a shit about elbows. <laughs> oh my god! Dude, I'm so proud of you, man. I'd like to see you try, motherfucker. Yeah, okay, I'm allowing you to speak despite your annoyingly high voice. So have some respect. Annoyingly high voice. You expect me to have a deep voice and a tall boy? You're the tallest guy in the room, but I'm the smallest butt in the city. Eat something! Eat something! You look like a charity auction of drumsticks! <laughs> Great, back with the skinny jokes. <laughs> Who said skinny people can't be hot? Oh, sure you can be hot. Thank you, bud. Just hold a lighter next to me next time I fart, you'll be as hot as a fucking bonfire. <laughs> Skinny people don't need to be set on fire to be hot, okay? Fine, you tell me what you think is hot. Well, I like big butts and I cannot have all you other brothers. Oh, so you have to be big to be hot. Hey, that's what I like, okay? That's what I like. You can like whatever you want. I guess you're into broomsticks and tube lights and PVC bikes. <laughs> I like women with big briefs, okay? Small women with whom I can have an interesting conversation. Please, Casey! None of these girls are into you! Don't even try that! I'm so deep, please fuck me bullshit! <laughs> so I can't have a preference! I can't have a preference! Fine, tell us. What do you, what do you prefer? Eh? What do you prefer uh, physically? I like boobs. And I guess I want someone with a nice waist. Someone who's not as skinny as me because I like hearts. Jesus! I'm attached to a fucking wuss! <laughs> it's funny the way you people process body parts, and I'm talking to you, all of you now. You know what I see when I peek out from this idiot's low jeans? <laughs> Everyone looks like a fucking Lego brick set to me. Augment parts, bit by bit, boobs, butt, face. I think the new name for the new human race is like a Halloween party at Frankenstein's house. Every single time when I go out, I see people and I feel like shouting out, It's alive! It's alive! <laughs> Men, women, people, and everyone in between worrying too much what other people are seeing. I have a suggestion, fuckers. Go jump in a vat of toxic waste. Sixteen-year-old girls these days look like they have so much makeup that they like, look like Batman supervillains anyway. And the guys are all trying to be Wolverine with cuts all the way until they have 14 abs and quadruple quadriceps. It's like they want to say, let's get some DC versus Marvel going on in real life. Oops. Spandex isn't in, so let's get some skinny jeans. But skinny jeans doesn't make you Jean Grey. Okay? So all you're left with is the public that looks like its nipples are going to shoot right out of its shirts at any second. No other power, no purpose, no adventure, just internal organs about to rupture. Do you know how many innocent butts like me are strangled half to death and pants too tight? I swear these people have forgotten how to fart right. Do you know how many boobs are fed up of their owners for getting smashed together till they're almost merged with one another? They're going to be uni boobs very soon, people. Uni boobs very soon. Fucking you people need to relax. We're just bits attached to you like fruit on a tree. Squeezing the fucking juice out of us doesn't make you sexy. Why are you telling me? Why are you yelling at me? I don't do any of this shit.
shitting me! You skinny bastard, you don't have a choice! <laughs> okay, I'm I'm not even gonna go there. Okay, I'm gonna shut the fuck up. Right? <laughs> so friends, that's pretty much the kind of conversation I have with my butt when I'm high on a very specific kind of drug. And the high is coming down now, so I will see you next time. Bye fuckers! Sure! <laughs>